rural areas have significant health care disparities compared to urban areas because of the physician shortages. And that um, spans the spectrum of all specialties, but also includes primary care. In rural communities in particular, there just are, simply are not enough doctors to take care of the number of patients that are there. So patients have to make decisions, right, about where do they go or do they not go to get care. To try to get providers to come to rural areas is harder. Uh, recruitment is always a little bit of a struggle. I think sometimes people might want to go and practice in a rural area, but their partner or their spouse doesn't want to live in a rural area. Just trying to maintain consistent providers for patients is really hard. So we're always a little bit underserved, under-resourced. Brandon Drews is a third-year medical student at UC Davis. Hi, my name's Brandon. And he's on the cusp of helping to reshape how the school is training doctors for rural communities. He is the first student from UC Davis to receive medical training out of state under a novel partnership with Oregon Health and Science University, or OHSU. The collaboration is known as Compadre, and it seeks to address the doctor shortage in both states by sending students and residents to train in clinics and hospitals between Sacramento and Portland. You know, being from a rural area, knowing the needs of a rural community, uh, I thought it was phenomenal that we have this program to shepherd students into these careers to fill these gaps. Drews has chosen to spend six weeks at Cascades East Family Medicine Center in Klamath Falls, a city of 22,000 just north of the California border. They do a really good job of guiding you into acting like a physician. I've seen a range of concerns from patients, everything from musculoskeletal aches and pains, to psychiatric complaints, to reproductive complaints, the, the whole gamut. I think this is a pivotal moment for the medical school, having students in Oregon and at our partner sites. The hope then is that as students choose to rotate there, then they'll stay there for residency. We certainly know that when a physician trains in a residency program, about 60% of them stay within about 100 miles of that program. Despite the rich hands-on opportunities for students in Klamath Falls, the clinic continually struggles to draw doctors to practice there. That's why recruiters often emphasize the region's natural beauty or the advantages of living in small towns. It's a great, great place to live, great place to practice. If you like the outdoors, it's wonderful. It's a really beautiful area. Anything you want to get outside and enjoy, we've got over 300 days of sunshine in Klamath Falls a year, which is huge. Uh, and it's a nice kind of high desert climate and pretty amenable to getting out and doing things. I think the most important thing that UC Davis School of Medicine provides is the opportunity to come out to these rural locations and, and treat these communities. But while we're out here, of course, they support us. They provide housing and they make sure that we're connected up with people at Cascades East out here in Klamath Falls who can direct us to things to do in the community and to find out exactly where we are and who this community is. My wife came up for a weekend and we got out to see Crater Lake, which is about an hour north of here. And on that same trip, we saw these beautiful waterfalls and there's Umqua Hot Springs. So we went out and hiked out to some hot springs and sat in hot springs that overlook the river just an hour and a half north of here. I think that practicing, training, and living in the same place is vitally important to your function as a doctor. You have to know what it's like day to day living here. You have to know the struggles they face and you have to be intimately familiar with the resources that are available to them. That only happens if you live here. Regardless of which specialty I end up in, my wife and I absolutely see ourselves settling down in a small town, someplace rural. We both like the rural environment and we both recognize that the opportunities that you give up by leaving a large city are more than made up for by the opportunities that exist out here in these kinds of places.